Okay, I've done some brief <clears throat> finagling with settings, and I think we're at 60 frames per second now. Uh, I don't think we were in the last one. Um, I'm trying to not speed too much through, like, double-checking things, but I'm like, I have a limited time. It's already noon. <laughs> like, it took, I had to do a lot of, like, graphic updates and stuff before I started playing earlier, which slowed me down, and I was like, no. Okay, but we are heading towards the last trial, which this is very uneven, I guess, but... Your path lies before me. A long way to go still. Yeah, you get to be in the front. On I go. You get to do all this stuff that I don't want to do as a person. Oh, okay. Oh, we are in the silent library. There's people-ish. Uh, they don't seem aggressive, but we can't cast spells. Oh, what that? Can I talk to them? No, I can only attack them. Oh, they are aggressive. They are just red. Um. <laughs> yeah, I was like, um. Okay. Yikes. Let's see if we can't get your boy. You can't cast any spells, it just is a thing. I'm like, oh no. Uh, missed! He had all those, like, things going for him and he missed. Boy. Nature shall be defended. Yeah. At any cost. Oh, okay, okay. Um. Thunder and Mew. Well, that sucks. We might have to transform. Necrotic resistance, but radiant vulnerable, except none of that matters, because we can't cast any freaking spells. But, yeah, I'm, we're gonna have to have, uh, house and change shape. We can shred armor and regenerate hit points, that's cool. Eighteen! You better have more than eighteen, but it goes, every, it goes up every two druidic levels. And web. I mean, I feel like it's cheating, but the owl bear seems like the best one for the most part, you know. Let's try uh, saber tooth tiger because I want to be cool. <gasps> oh, I thought I wouldn't let him for a second. Yeah, I know. The game is like you're new, and I'm like, no, I'm not. <laughs> Red armor can't reach him. There. Oh, what is that? What is it? Like a trap? Yeah, I mean, I know this is a. I know there's rows of books there. <laughs> what? I. <laughs> That's pretty obvious. Let's try this one. Sluggardly. Jugular strike again. Sure. I don't think they can bleed, so not that it's a bleed thing, I think. Interesting. Okay. I am gonna have to break that's the librarian way. Am I gonna have to like do something with that? Did somebody just Oh, I was like, did someone just drop something on our heads? But no. Why are the just this year's map? Maybe if we had just come in. <gasps> what if just Shadowheart had come in? Hang on, I'm gonna save and I'm gonna experiment. Which is excruciating, especially on the laptop, because reloading takes ages, even on the desktop. But I'm gonna try. Because she's the one who went through the trials. So we might just get her to go in there. Although, to be fair, Asterion kind of helped <laughs> on the one. <laughs> and it kind of seems to, like, give us, like, it kind of seems to spread effects of things sometimes. Where it's, like, like obviously my, my character walked in and Char was, like, at, at one point where Char and Char was, like, Oh, you are bad at this. 
And it's like, I didn't do it, Shadowheart did it. But it treats us all kind of the same, so that's why I don't think it's going to maybe do much. But we'll see. I just got the announcement. Apparently, Baldur's Gate 3 passes Elden Ring and Breath of the Wild to become the first game to win all five major Game of the Year awards. I think the BAFTA awards are going on right now. Uh, so, sick. Well-deserved, obviously. Okay, let's have... Can't afford to stay idle. Shadowheart. Go on in. Nope, they look aggressive. Aw, uh, oh, dang, Nabbit. I was really hoping. I guess we could have, like, tried to sneak through? Nah, whatever. I'm just gonna go back to where I was. Wow, oh, this is absolutely not what she's made for. I don't know how to undo... I mean, it's a silent library. I don't think we can undo it. I can divine smite. Woo! Hey, yeah! Can't reach destination. No, can I reach this one? Nope. I'm too slow. God darn it! Ghoulish touch. Where'd I get that? But these are immune. They're weak to radiant, but they and they're only immune to thunder, but they're just resistant to everything else. Well, I think I'm gonna try to scoot down as far as I can to see if I can. Uh, it's only one dreadful aspect. I can't do anything. Ooh. Can I control undead? Are these spirits? Maybe. Duh. Alas. You shouldn't be able to cast spells, neither. We can do, like, our, I think, like, our intrinsic stuff, like our class stuff. What are you beckoning darknessing my my guy for, huh? And I need you to not. I'm really hoping you didn't make Oh, it's just like a necromantic thing. Okay. No, not Halcyn. The undead behind Halcyn. Or the disadvantage. I'm gonna let Halcyn finish that one off. Why are we disadvantaged on these people? Critical miss and just a regular miss. Sick. Um. Oh, you're the one doing the silence, Aura. Alright, I'm going down here. Maybe. Freaky. Oh, wait. I'm Shadowheart. Never mind. Okay, I'll take my character down there, maybe, but. For now, Shadowheart's just <laughs> kind of doing nothing. Hey! Oh, but we shouldn't attack. Like, that one's frightened, so maybe... I'm, like, just out of range of everything. I could use Divine Sense only like, two turns, so I don't want to waste it. Ah, okay. Well, now that you're in biting range... <gasps> it's okay, he has regenerative. Oh, shoot! 62! Nice, I just realized that <clears throat> Halson's health is pretty high, which is good. So far, Halson's doing the best out of everybody. No thick eye. Ooh, you can make invisibility with that. Let's see, we get him moving. Ooh, that was cool. Yeah, you just shot the floor, actually. I've done that before, also. That guy's frightened again because of the shot, I think, from Halson. Let's see if we can't uh, steal some money. I don't know. 
Love it. Nope. I did that a lot of damage, actually. <laughs> I didn't think it would. Oh, plus three. That's right, that's right. Never mind. We don't get money, and that was, like, silly. Never mind. Whatever. These guys don't have any money, guaranteed. Divine Strike. Target cannot be an inanimate entity. Are you Fine. I will Divine Strike. Are you serious? Well, at least I didn't get to use- I think mean, you don't use it up. Are you serious? Alright. We are putting Divine Sense on. Jeez. Oh, that was no. You jerk. They do keep missing also. Like, wow. They keep missing Shadow R. I wonder if she's specifically protected? I don't know. Nope, okay. Did it with advantage, god darn it. Oh yeah, I forgot that one was there. There's like four of them here. I'm just trying to hit the full health ones because I think I can obliterate them in one go. Oh, that one has one health. I didn't... Yeah, okay. You're not right back there, Starion? Oh, no. I knew it! They're bringing people- that this stupid thing is bringing people back. Ah, uh, okay, I gotta hit that thing instead, I think. I- I- oh, it's gone now. Oh, okay. Sweet. Right? I surely hope so. Okay, well, let's... He gets to run very far. It's very nice. Perfect. Love it. How's it? I just, I love that I'm just having him like go around the outskirts. Like, you do be uh, just destroying everybody up top. And seeing him, he can jump so far. Like, it's really cool watching him as like a, a saber tooth tiger, right? All right, we got one. Good job. Oh, and now we can do spells. All right, well, I'm smacking the crap out of everybody. Radiant, radianting all over you people. Light on my feet. A what? Oh, a button for the row of books? Disarming? Oh, maybe if we had try if we try to activate the bookcases without doing disarming something, the bookcases might get angry at us. You know, as bookcases do. <laughs> Watching the animals navigate steps is kind of funny. Try a radiant thing? I don't know, Sacred Flame is not great, but. There we go. Still on my feet. Still up? Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay. There's a trap. Okay, well, we are apparently going to have to have Asterion run around disarming the crap out of everything. Okay, so I think that was- oh no. 
I don't know what that disarmed, but this one's probably this one right here. Teaching of loss. Lights, love, blah, blah, blah. Looking ahead. Uh, what are we, we're, this is where the final trial is. I hope we didn't already fail if I have to fight everybody. This is also where the relic apparently is. Maybe it's a book. Love is the cruelest of all the lies used by Lady Shars foes. It is a disease, a disease, one that can ensnare hearts for a lifetime over something as slight as a passing glimpse. Love is arson, a destructive flame, offering fleeting light and comfort to the one who feeds it, while insulting Lady Shars cold, infinite darkness. Extinguish the flames of love. They shall burn you with their heat, choke you with their acrid smoke, and in the end, leave you with nothing but cold ashes and a hungry heart. Isn't that what Shar wants? Isn't that a, isn't that a Shar thing? It just seems very, forward. um... I don't know, uh, counterintuitive, I guess? I, I'm just gonna keep him as a saber tooth tiger for now. I am ready. Oh! I lit this one up here, and something happened. Like, it sounded like something moved. Actually, I keep thinking, I think it's Halson. He does like a growl noise, and I keep thinking he, it's, um,. It's like something moving around, and I think it's just him. See that noise? That makes me. Th that, it makes me think something is moving. Teachings of loss. Read. Uh, something just happened. A dense tome written in an elegant script outlining the teachings of Shar. Loss teaches us the truth. It is void. Are we our purest expressions of ourselves? There's nothing nobler than to forget and to surrender oneself to the darkness for the little grief that gets us there. The dark lady rewards us with night's internal embrace. What did we just perception roll? Hysterian failed a perception. How delicious. Well, I feel like maybe it's a double trap. Step carefully. Yeah, where there's, there's um. Like, if we can disarm the butts, we also need to disarm the buttons. I just had a thought. I was like, oh, if this was, like, real life, I'd just be having a stereo and running around disarming things. But that probably, and, like, the rest of us, like, kind of going slowly and looking at, like, the books and stuff. But I could definitely see how that would get us into trouble, also. <laughs> it's like, la la la, and then a stereo, like, blows up, and we're like, oh my god! There's no time to waste. A stereo! Tome of the Soft Step Trial. The ancient tome advises Char and initiates how to triumph in the soft step trial. They must excel in some of Lady Char's most cherished arts. And blah, 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 blah. The unstable are uh, gonna fail. Okay, you can have the book. I don't want it. Um, teachings of Lost, the Night Singer. Who can silence the night song? <gasps> Is this the night song? Is the relic the night song? Oh my gosh. Only the night singer herself, Char. Who can silence the night song? Only the night singer herself, Char. Mistress of the night, lady of loss, her names are many, but her purpose is simplicity itself. Light was a mistake, and life is an illusion. A discordant song composed of lies, breaking the peace of oblivion. Put your faith in Char as your champion, allow her to silence a false song in your heart, and return you to her embrace. I think this is all you need, eternal womb, where you are safe in darkness with Mother Char. Oh, come on, give me some night song clues. Did I not pick it up? Pick up. The wind is like going wild outside. It's like shaking. This it was not windy at all go. yesterday. Shaking my little trailer. Come on, somebody notice. Wow, we're just failing all over the place. We can't. Well, let's avoid that trap. The final sacrifice of the Moon Daughter. Well, I hope it doesn't blow up on me in this bookcase. It is said that the sacred spear was once built by the Night Singer herself, and now awaits her chosen champion. The others have placed it in a secret place, if until the Lieutenant Glitter discovers it. Within an hand, a final sacrifice can be made at last, and the foul moon with saloon shall weep bitter tears and forsake our misguided followers. But let no ambition of the night be tempted to seize the spear for themselves, unbidden, for they shall find it in an inner bubble, stripped of its holy purpose. Let all of Lady Shara's children be honored to protect the sacred instrument. When the time comes, they shall know they aided the progress of Lady Shara's destined warrior and helped usher in the return uh, to the endless ecstasy of oblivion. Oh, that's right. 
To make her a dark justicia, we're supposed to have her murder a Selenite. To live in more interesting times. Oh, not me! Not me, actually. Oh, jeez, that's not who I want to... No, 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 no. Don't touch me. I'm not going to. I want you to touch this. Come on. Yay. Now we have... Shadow heart. And blades always sharp. Read the self same trial. Blah blah blah. blah. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Okay. I wonder if we need to be pushing the buttons actually. I can't use this right now. Why? I pulled a lever earlier, didn't I? Can't use this right now. Hmm. That worked. The door's open. Oh. Okay. This is how people sometimes. I was reading. I was listening to a raccoon podcast of all things. There's an episode on ologies about raccoons, and they're like, people mistake raccoons are smart for what they are. But people sometimes mistake a raccoon's tenacity for intelligence. And I think that said something a lot about people and raccoons and everybody in general, <laughs> honestly. Or it's like, if you just work at a problem long enough, sometimes just by banging pieces together, something will just accidentally work. It's the same thing with raccoons. People are like, oh, they're so clever with their little hands. And it's like, no, they'll just spend six hours banging something together until it breaks, probably. And then it or like accidentally undo something. You know what I mean? And I was like, that's, I think that just, I think there's a lesson in that, you know? <laughs> Riddle of the night. Well, let's see what else. There's another lever. Teachings of loss. Own secret. Trump. Ah! Oh, jeez. We just walked over it. I'm pretty sure. Lady Shard knows what you bury deep inside your spirit. She knows what pains you, gnaws away at your very being. Be open with her about your failings. Let her place the soothing hand of oblivion upon her wounds. Let her know you utterly so she can release you from your shackles. Okay, so before anybody Careful. does anything. Ah, anything wild. No, but don't. I know. Uh, they all, like, move around to be around the, like, a character who's selected. And it's like, please don't. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Oh, there's another one. You, boy. Watch your back. I mean, he's older than me, I guess, but. Well, I don't know how old my character is. Uh, she's like in her 30s for an elf. Human years, elf years, I don't know. Elf years, ha years. Blah, 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 blah. Anymore? Oh dear. Yeah. Someone's left a trap out for us. Uh oh. Trap. Okay. <laughs> I was like, I know what's here. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that figure, it's maybe like a, an illusion, maybe? Ooh, ah, <gasps> oh, I saw something in there! Just briefly on the way back out? Okay, I can't see it now. Hmm. The Riddle of Shar. what do you want, what do you gotta say for yourself? The Riddle of a Night. What can silence the night song? Oh! The... The Shar statue. The only thing that can that can silence the night song is Shar herself. And so, if we use the Shar idol, maybe. Let me look at these things first. Emptiness is a holy state, one to be perused and admired. To will to void oneself of all feeling, all attachment is to approach the purity of Lady Shar's embrace. We must each struggle in our own way from the temptations of light and life. Remember that all those false comforts will betray you in the end. Only the sacred nothing is will endure. Any, any other tidbits? Let's see what we have here.
that? Oh. I guess we could have run in and then closed the door. So they couldn't come in after us. We're at the rummage. We're at the rummage. Ooh. Confusion. Greater invisibility. Scroll of shocking grace. I'm sure, taking out those. Um. Oh, if the iron. Oh, no, like if the iron core calls us up, I can't. Okay, it's like being weird. What can silence the light song? Let me see. I think it might be one of the, like, umbral things that we have. Oh. Did I get it back? That was an idol in Shar, right? Yeah. I feel like that should have worked. I feel like that should have worked. I was, like, trying to think. I'm, like, I could, like, turn the lights out. Like, but it's something that has to be inserted. And I put a freaking... silence the lights on. Put a freaking idol of Char in there, and that didn't do anything. Look, freaking, she does have the light cantrip. I've been distracted with other things for the last minute or so, but look, she does have light. Where did the daylight one go? I swear she had daylight. Like I had her. Ha oh, it's over there. Ah, yeah, I see what I did. <laughs> there it freaking is. I knew she had it. I didn't think I didn't use it. Oh, that's fine. Uh, anyway, I am this close to cheating. Um, this close. Do I want to like, press any of these buttons? Oh, good, this Maybe? Way. No, it's gotta be something to insert. And these buttons don't look pushable anymore. Stop making noises! His, his growl sounds just like something being, like, like, a, like a stone item being moved across a stone floor. Come back here. You got, you got something, Skellington? You got any secrets for me that will help me? Please? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Useless skeleton shoved in. Oh. What? <laughs> Closed library. <laughs> I just ate my words, maybe. Only those who have proved themselves worthy of the Mistress of Night are invited to look upon her secrets. Four controls adorn these walls. One permits entry. Place yourself in the center and to the northwest corner. Ah, okay. I already did that. See, this is why you gotta look at all the skeletons. You gotta look at all the corners. Why that person died, I don't know. Is there something else in this corner that I'm missing? That will solve all my problems? Seeing as how, I can't... Because I uploaded Baldur's Gate 3 to my laptop... Well, it's mostly on an external hard drive, but some of the files have to be on the desktop, or on the modern, or whatever, the laptop itself. Um... I don't have a ton of time or recording space, so I'm going to look it up because I feel like doing the Umbral Gem was what it was like what was required of me, or the the Shar thing, which I felt very clever about, and um, apparently that was wrong. Riddle of the night, BG3, first thing that pops up. Oh, the answer is a book titled Teachings of Lost. Oh, it's the it's the book. Okay. Okay, won't read any further. What can silence the light? I thought I thought I was being pretty clever, 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 yeah. clever with the idol of Shar, but it would be a, it would make sense. It would be a book in a library that would be the solution. Oh yeah. I wish you could just like click like when you when when it comes up with this. I wish you could just click on an item in your inventory and it would go in. Instead, you have to like drag it in. Yay! Did I get the book back? Thanks. Okay. All right. All right. All right. There is a. I figured there was the weapon in here because there was that thing we read about a weapon. Do we get to have it, though, is the thing. Dark Justice Year, Half Plate, Spear of Night, Gilded Chest, Plaque. Let's read the plaque. Deliver the Night Mother's mercy upon her enemies. Yeah, well, the thing is, is we don't have a, a Selu Knight. Oh? Oh. 
we don't have a selenite sacrifice here, so I don't know if what we're gonna do is. I thought we would do that anyway. Shroud yourself in blackest night. Black, 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 black. Oh, black. Trust your secrets to the night. Maybe I don't. Maybe I don't. Um, okay. Quick save. Which takes ages on my laptop. Come on, darling, you've done it. I have like 300 saves in this game. I desperately need to delete some. This is no ordinary spear. May be important. Best keep it close. Uh, okay. Is that it? Um, I mean, I felt like we should be like, you know, yay, Shadowheart, you've done the done the thing you wanted. Sort I mean you've kinda become a dark just this year. Shars Aegis, nice. She does look very intimidating. She's not really a spear girly, I thought. Oh, okay, so we can do the one handed spear. That's cool. Um is it worse than a little worse. Use this spear to kill Night Song if Shar allows it. Uh, Night Song person? Night Song. Per I mean, if Night Song is a relic, it makes sense that it's a person because, like I said, I think it's an entity, a living entity, or an undead entity, some sort of entity uh, created by that evil Balthazar necromancer guy. Um. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I don't necessarily want to kill the Night Song, but we've got the option. Um, what I'm a little weirded out by is that nothing's popped up. Like, nothing's like, oh, yay, furthering your quest for knowledge or whatever, you know? I'm like, okay. Like, furthering the progress of, like, Night Song or the Relic, you know, none of those have popped up. And so I'm like, I'm a little concerned. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and call this one here. Hopefully it's not too short. I probably edited out a bunch of fighting stuff, but you gotta take them while we can, because I also can't let my laptop overheat too much, so I gotta give it a break. So thank you all for joining me. I appreciate it. Really quick one, I say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, including my Acorn Tier patrons. Thank you so much, Fang, for your support. I very much appreciate it, and I want to give an extra special shout out to Reese Comito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my forest tier patron, who has gone above and beyond in his support of me and the channel, and who I truly cannot think enough. So thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.